I grew up a choir boy. I spent each and every Sunday morning at the early service up in the choir loft singing hymns and anthems, and it's where I developed my love for music and song. My choir director was a wise woman by the name of Tracy Depew. God bless her still beating heart. She taught me many things, but one I hold most dear, and most relevant to this piece, is a quote, Enemies cannot exist as long as the music lasts. From Tracy's stance, it was a reminder to us petty, riotous high school students that no matter what had happened at school that week, regardless of what had been said about whom, when we joined to sing, those concerns fall away. When I think back on this mantra now, it speaks to me about the power of song. Music is the great communicator, a bridge for conflict. It connects those who hear it in a shared emotion or passion. I mean, think about the power of hymns and other religious songs and uniting people around a religion or battle songs and rallying troops for a cause. Sometimes a single song rises as the anthem of a generation, bringing together all folks of an age or a culture. Sometimes the connectivity of music is as simple as two strangers connecting over a favorite song playing at a coffee shop. I love the Smiths. Sorry? I said I love the Smiths. You've, you've good taste in music. You like the Smiths? Yeah. All this is to say that I believe music is powerful, and more so than we recognize. It's an art of emotion. It brings people together. In this day and age, we need community, and we need relationships. And so, we also need music.